Hello guys. Welcome back to my channel. We all know by default, Laravel allows user to log in with their email and password only, which might get you stocked when meet a project that requires that user should log in with their email or username alongside with their password. In this tutorial, I will teach you how to add login with an email or username feature on Laravel 9. This feature allows your users to log in with email or their username after registration. And we are going to achieve this with a fresh Laravel project. Please if you find this video helpful and informative, don't forget to hit the like button, share, subscribe and turn on notification to get notified when I post a new video. Let's start by creating a new Laravel project on the terminal. If you are running PHP 8 and above, this command will create Laravel 9 project for you. But if you are running lower versions of PHP, it will create Laravel 8 project for you. But don't worry, you can still follow this tutorial to implement it in any of your Laravel projects. Let me cd to the project folder and serve the project. Next, I'm going to open my browser to view the project. Let's install Laravel UI, which will allow us to use the Laravel default auth system. Next, I'm going to scaffold the front-end assets using Vue. Then run npm install. Before running any npm command, make sure node is installed in your system. I'm going to run npm run dev and npm run watch, to mix and build the front-end assets files. After running npm run watch, press Ctrl C to exit the watch, as we're not going to make changes to any of the front-end asset files. Now, our registration and login page is ready. Let me open the project in my code editor. Next, I'm going to add the username field in the user's migration file. Then add username to fillable in the user model. Let me add my database credentials to the environment file.
Let's open the register blade file and add the username input field. And then open the register controller and add the username field too. Next, I'm going to modify the email field in the login blade file, changing the email field to username, which will accept either email or username as login credential. After everything is set, I will now run migration to create the tables we need. Let's register a user whose credentials we will use to test the functionality of what we're trying to implement. To implement login with email or username functionality, we will have to override the Laravel username method which is inside the Laravel authenticates user trait, that is inside the Laravel core folders. By default, the trait uses email as the field and column to validate user login credentials. To override the username method, we will have to create a username method inside the login controller. that will allow us login with email or username inside the username method we created. First, we will get the user input. Then check if the input is email or just a text, using PHP filter variable function, with the option of filter validate email. If the input value is email, it's going to return email, else it will return username.
Next, we are going to merge the value we got from the check, and finally return the login type, which will be either email or username. error on the blade file is checking for only username. Let's duplicate the error message to show for both email and username errors. Fine, let's get the correct credentials from our database, first we will log in with email, and then log in with our username. Please if you find this tutorial helpful and informative, don't forget to like, share, subscribe and ring the notification bell icon, to get notified whenever I upload a new video, see you in the next video. Thanks for watching.